Oh, well, there's Santa Claus. So that may be Cody playing the role of Santa Claus in this year's production of Christmas at the Hub. All he's missing is uh, a sack. <laughs> if he had a sack, maybe he wouldn't be putting up with this nonsense from his girlfriend, ex-girlfriend, girlfriend, ex-girlfriend there on the floor. Or whoever she is. Whatever she is. Previously on Trough's 12 Vids of Christmas. Yeah, she's talking to Cody. You were in jail because you're dumb and make bad decisions. She comes to the hot property just to scream that she's a whore. Okay. Your loud mouth made it my business. You stupid, ridiculous, dumb poo- Shut up. This is the attitude that somehow this is their building. It's Christmas Eve. peaceful Christmas Eve. Those of us at and around the hub are not. I have a pretty good feeling she might be back. She's back. So I told you she'd be back. She wants to shit on his face. Wow. They're letting her in despite all of it. Help these people all you like to somewhere more appropriate where the attendees can yell and scream and throw things all they like on Christmas Eve. That's her again. Whatever it was, they let her in for about a half an hour. She's got a pile of stuff with her because now you can hear her. They did kick her back out and she's pissed. You got a new coat. What are you complaining about? Putting up with this nonsense from his girlfriend, ex-girlfriend, girlfriend. He looks uh, dismayed, troubled. Fed up? Like, what is she even whining about? I, I, I miss you, I love you, I hate you. All in the same sentence. Okay, everyone have a seat outside. as a big show for all the neighbors to see and hear. And then, let's be shocked when someone picks up a camera, starts filming it, and posts it on the reality of the Hub Exposed. Okay, now they're deciding to go for a walk into the basketball court. She's parked herself in the corner there and wrapped herself up in a blanket. Okay, let's get a quick shot of the clock here. It's 10 to 6. Okay, we cannot have this. I'm sure they realize that. I'm glad that uh, there's uh, no snow there in the patch she selected of the basketball court. The patch of concrete she selected. Uh -oh. The story is not over tonight. Not yet. It's 5.51 p.m. Well, it's a couple minutes later, and she is still there, hosting the pity party. I'm sure someone will come to her rescue very soon. Okay, well, that didn't, that didn't take long. Six oh one. Definitely got to get this from the other side now. There's the clock. Can anyone join me in singing a round of Silent Night and maybe we'll get one? Wow. Yeah, it's Christmas. Get it through your head. You're most likely in this situation because of the bad decisions you made. Learn and understand and acknowledge this phrase. This is all my fault. That'll be the first day of the rest of your life and you can start getting somewhere.
Why are you doing this to us? Okay, Cody, I mean, the girl's on her hands and knees there, you know, on the concrete, maybe. Come out and tell her to leave or tell her to come in or tell her something. 